No, I mean, look at this place. It's so good. I'm like so impressed of all the work that they put and all the ambition that they, they bring to the table. And yeah, it's just inspiring to have people like Armando and Lisa who really put their heart into what they do and, uh, and really do everything they can. And it, you can see the result. It's really something. This is incredible. I'm so glad for them. They really deserve this and more and I only wish all the best for the future. Well, in the beginning was a great idea and as Amanda and Lisa just showed how much it needs to get to this point and I think the result is just marvelous. Well, first of all, the place is really beyond anything I could have expected. It's beautiful, it's so big and so stylish and everything just looks so super professional. Uh, it's just wonderful for, for Basel, I think. I'm in love with this new space comparing to the other one, you know, it's much bigger and stuff, but at the same time as a new rejuvenation in the atmosphere, there's new lights in the studio, I think the people are very happy. But it's great for the city to have something like this, to have different people coming together to have a, a space for art, especially also for kids, because I think it's important for them to have this, so it's really something special. Armando and Lisa have done such an inspiring job. Um, to see what they've been able to do for the community and also being able to bring local businesses here from Basel, also to have outsiders outside of the dance community come in and feel like this is a safe space for them, it's really remarkable. And also knowing who they were in New York, it also gives us foreigners a place to feel like Basel could also be a sliver of home for us. Um, and that all of the languages and different backgrounds can be something that transcends in a space like this. I got to know Armando when he was still with Ballet Basel and I found him a very positive person with a very good attitude. So when he came up with the idea of opening a Brasel Art Center just before uh, at Ausstrasse, I was uh, thinking, wow, that's uh, quite a jump from being a dancer in a company to become really an entrepreneur. But uh, he has a very big heart and he also has the motivation from all he has experienced in his life. And you would not only see that from his dancing, but also from his entrepreneurial spirit. So when he started up this place, I recalled the email uh, he sent me and initially I really had to breathe uh, and I thought, wow, this guy needs a lot of money to do that and he's putting a lot at risk, obviously. But, um, you know, having seen how he's built it up and the ideas all behind, I think he's going to succeed in what he does. So I wish all the success to Armando and to Lisa uh, to make this success story one for everybody. Um, and I know they're also sharing their aspiration and inspiration with a lot of people and hopefully they can inspire a lot of people doing good things here at the Braswell Art Centre.